there's no way to understand at all what this experience is going to be like until you are actually in here doing it. This is a well-oiled machine, this residency program, and I've done a lot of different residencies, and like having Kristen and Garrett and Sherry around has made this possible. Without everything they do, there's no way I would get anything done. There's a vast amount of knowledge here, and just it's all right there at our fingertips, which is great. I've learned so much. I didn't know anything about metalworking when I got here, so this is all brand new to me. I work with found furniture. I'm trained as a woodworker. I take that furniture and alter it and make it into other things. And I work with found furniture for a couple of reasons. I'm trying to open a dialogue sort of about consumer culture and sustainability and our culture of disposability. But I also like it because the chair references a person and all those marks and wear on the chair are more directly connected to the people whose lives it literally supported. What's been great for me here at Arts and Industry is that I no longer have to think about myself as strictly as a woodworker. I've done so much problem solving and built so many different things that I've realized that all of that problem solving can translate really fluidly into a different material that's not wood. So by working in cast iron, I can move pieces outside, and I really like to work on a larger scale that's often too big for inside somebody's home. Another reason I'm interested in this transition to iron is I think a lot of my work lately, I've been using a lot of black and black finishes and moving away from the patinas and the history on the chair, it's such a country style wood chair, to put it into iron, all of a sudden it removes it from its original form and becomes much more just this linear object. I really enjoy working in this environment. I'm really comfortable here. The people are so nice. Everybody has been so helpful and so friendly. There is a support group here for the artists, which is really helpful. One of the biggest drives for me as a maker is to continually challenge myself in problem solving. This is definitely doing that.